You're ready? You're ready? You're ready? Yes. 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 You have you just stepped out into, into, into the world, world, world of chaos. chaos. Where everybody, Where everybody goes, goes hard. hard. We beat Jamal Mashburn in them. And we beat Hempstead with Cal Ivy Jones, uh, the big left hand. We, y'all, watch this. You understand, 1990 at the time, that class, G, that was the best class of New York City players ever at the time. That class, that class is Adrian Autry, Jamal Mashburn was our Mr. Basketball, Brian Reese, uh, Derek Phelps, Kylie Reeves, Rob Phelps, Chanel Scott, me, James Hector. This is our whole all. Our all city team, right? They said that was the best class of New York City basketball ever. I'll put it this way I turned down the Dapper Dan All American game in Pittsburgh, and I wound up going to school there, but because I thought I should have been McDonald's All American because of the work that I was putting in. So, so, so you, 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 you turned down. Dapper Dan because you didn't make the McDonald's? Yep. I was feeling myself. And it's mm. the fun thing about it. You got to think. We had so much talent. Rob Phelps didn't make the McDonald's All-American game. Yeah, we talked about that. And he's the hey, number Rob, 15 scorer in New York State history. What? Time out, time out. Rob was number one when he left Nazareth. Yeah, I figured he that, was yeah. He state leading scorer when he left Nazareth. Number one. High end in the McDonald's All-American game. But yeah, again, that's real. You gotta understand politics because, but the ones that we had in there wasn't no slouches. It wasn't like they shouldn't have been there. D. Phelps, Khaled, Mash, Adrian B. I think that's the five. We have five on the East team. So it's more or less like if they'd have put any more New York City cats on there, they'd have been like the country would have been like, y'all just gave this shit to New York City. So let me explain. Let me explain something to you. Uh -huh. There's an article. People can look this up. There's a New York Times article that basically says the Regis exam mm -hmm. was put in place to stop the influx of basketball players coming out of New York City. Yeah. That it was it was written, Watch I think, it. in 2012. Yo, to something like that, let me voice how my mom voiced shit to me. If I would have went to her with something like that. You prepare yourself for everything. Facts, facts. No matter what, yo, yo, we're black males. I was taught growing up by my mother. You had two strikes against you when you were born. You black and you a male, right? So my mother never had in her household that I'm black and I'm a male. I'm trying, but I'm black and I'm a male. They won't let me. F that. My mother's like, make it so that they have to let you in. You know everything. You know how to get there. Bro, watch this. My mother had uh, me and my brother doing book reports on, like, novels. Right by the camera, so you go to my house. I need right. to get a paper, 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 I was okay. saying that I was saying that to say not that it's it's an excuse, but the fact that we have so much talent that they just you know it's like the SAT yeah. exam they throw a little roadblock okay. to try to right, stop. Watch this. Right. I took the PSAT. Right. I bullshit. I came in one night. It was like <laughs> a Friday. I was hanging out with Jamal and or whatever, and I came in. My mother was like, "Don't you got to test them all?" I was like, "Ma, just the PSAT." She was like, you got to take it as this is right, the real thing. I was like, all right, I'm going to look at some stuff. I'm going there, all right. Okay, I got a 580 on that shit. My mother hit the roof. What? You get 200 for signing your name. See, this is right, what happens right. when you don't apply yourself and take those series. Just, I got something for you. My mom threw my ass 
in Stanley Kaplan's SAT class, right there on King's Highway, mm. by the D train, bro. And Pete, me and Juju was in there together. And that's my mother, that motherfucker funny. That nigga crazy, son. Nah, Juju was special. We was in class, I'm fucking trying to learn how to take this test. And that's all that test is. We know what's on that test. You gotta know how to take that test. That's what I got taught in Stanley Kaplan. I got taught how to basically hit something, you know it, hit it. If you don't, fuck that. You keep moving. Right, time, right. How you do your time. Bro, people don't know. I got a, I went from a 580, I got a 720, made me eligible. My mom didn't like the 720, made me take it again. I got a 1080, right? Nah, I'm not sitting here going, everybody know me. I'm wild dude. I was like, school, I did it, but. <laughs> I wasn't no A, 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 A. It's right, just about, right. I knew how to take that test. So that's what I mean about the regents test. It's more or less like if if they put something, okay, if that's put in front of us to stop us or uh, influence of New York City kids to get to college, then it's only going to stop the ones that don't have the head steam to understand is that that's not going to stop me from getting to college. Oh, no, no, no. It's, I, it, it's just, uh, just one of the things I wanted to point out. All right, so I want to get too deep. What up, Howie? Um, who who asked that you bust? That, that let you know you was ready. Keep it one hundred. I asked nah, anybody. That you. you know what? Okay. Keep it one hundred. There's no disrespect okay, right, to anyone. Son, I don't. You know me. My shit is Google me. <laughs> you fuck. My thing is that I can't say I bust somebody ass. That's what it was. I can tell you about maybe a game and. I think really when two times before my senior year, most people don't know is that my junior year, I made the New York Post all disappointment team. <laughs> wow. Yeah, people don't know. I made I went from my tenth grade year, I made honorable mention all city, my junior year, because that's when Mo came and coaches let Mo do what he wanted. And I was like, nah, fuck this little nigga. <laughs> and right. like, I unfolded my uniform and gave it to coach a couple of times, but I wasn't performing on the court. And actually, Grady, we didn't perform well. So I made the all disappointment team. We really to get, you know, everybody, Mo got his light as far as everybody's like Mo Brown as a freshman. Right, 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 right. But then what people don't understand is that that's that's intelligence. Me and Mo never took anything. Me, and we went and sat down and was like, "Yo, we don't hate each other. How do we figure this out on the court?" And that's when it went. I'm the one, and I put Mo at two. That's what people don't know. I played the one, and Mo was the two. Yeah, yeah, and and that was a crazy backcourt. All right, right. I know you're trying to be. I know you're trying to be politically correct. I'm gonna ask you this question again. All right, all right. Did you bust to let you know you was ready? Mm. Marco, he don't want to say it. It's right there in front of his face. I just want nah, to understand. It wasn't mash. It wasn't mash. It wasn't mash because before mash, I gotta say, it wasn't the first, because I can't say I killed you. I I didn't kill you, but it was that Lincoln game, my senior year, the first Lincoln game. And after that game, you know, me and Juju always pounded up after the game. That was the first time he grabbed me and was like, "If you play like that, that's when they gonna fucking." understand how good you are in he was like you don't play like that all the time and I, was like, mm. I got you son that was the guy yo i played so well that game zacky zach marbury came up to me crying was like fuck you ever my brother still put your ass <laughs> shout out to the marbury but so, so what was it game. so what was it about the mass burn game because people keep saying mass burn mass burn uh, okay we played against Mash. For one, I played with Mash at the Gauchos. So we knew each other. And and people don't know how quiet, gentle, killer giant he is, right? I'm going to tell you a story real quick about playing with him, and then I'll tell you about the state final game. Okay. I was playing for the Gauchos, right? So we used to have practice uptown, 149th Grand Concourse. On that team was me, Orlando Antigua, Jerry McCullough, Dennis wow. McCullough, Carlton Hines. Rest in Eric peace, Carlton Hines, my God. Rest in peace, Carlton Hines. Incredible. God damn, that boy was incredible. Carlton Hines, um, Eric Mobley, 
Shed. We had a nice day. That was the junior team at Mashburn, right? Right. So we would all get to the gym, and before practice started, we would play Utah. Right. Jesus, bro. All the names I just named, right? You have to understand is that Mashburn made all of us in Utah look like junior high school kids, bro. <laughs> this is what he used to do. We all playing Utah, right? So somebody shoot. He would get the rebound. If everybody know how Mash is built, he a little chubby. He a six seven. He ain't muscles all lie. He ran. Nah, nah, boy. nah. Baby that fat. Boy, smooth. He would get the ball and start announcing what he doing to us. He grabs the rebound, right? He goes. Mashburn gets the ball. Oh, he said they got him to the left. He goes behind his back. He see, he's saying this while seven of the best high school players, arguably right now in high school, on this AAU team, you got 6'10", you got athletic, you got short guards with hand dudes, you got jump shooters, you got sky, you got jumpers, and he is doing all this with everybody on him. And he's like, oh, he shimmy shakes. He shoots a fadeaway. Swat. Yo, the game before practice would be, you know, Utah, you get five points for the score. You get five points for the we, – we, we were shooting from the key. He ain't never missed those. When Jay you know, used to come in and blow the whistle, he'd be like, all right, all right, we're about to do practice. They'd be like, what you got? I got like 15. Somebody else got 20. Somebody got 25. Somebody got five. Mash, what you got? 80. I got a buck 20. He was incredible. So when people talk about that game, is that when we played them in the States, right, our first game was Hempstead. No, our first game was Cardinal Hayes with Mash. Mm -hmm. They was doomed because they only had Mash. The other players on their team thought that they was going to beat us by getting the ball to him. 